Hi everyone, this is Neil from Deacon Stack again, and I'm going to show you how to use a calculator feature now. So let's go ahead and start creating a form. So the idea is similar to what we did with logic jumps. If you've not watched that video, you can go watch that now. I'm going to create a simple COVID declaration form, uh, which we've seen a lot of people use. So let's say, have you been quarantined in the last 14 days? So what we're trying to do here is have a bunch of different questions based on which you can either deny or grant access. And that would be dependent on the score. So I'll show you how to do that. Let me just go ahead and add one more question. Have you been experiencing Right, so we've got three questions. Now let me just edit this and make all of them a required field. So you'll notice that we've also changed the UI here. So you can edit the question, duplicate it, add logic jumps directly from here, or even the calculator feature. Okay. So now go ahead to the calculation and hit add a calculation so when someone answers this question if the answer is yes then add one to the score now this is completely customizable based on your use case or if you want to give more weightage to a particular question you can increase the score here or have it lower it's totally up to you but for the purpose of this example i'm just going to have the same score for each of them so if somebody answers yes then just add one to the score now let's add our thank you screen so access is denied and access is granted all right so we've done that and let's go ahead and set up the logic jump so click on add logic jump and instead of the logic jump being based on the question, now it's going to be based on the score. So click on this and select score. If the score is equal to, um, let's say two. So if someone answers more than one question with the option yes, then that person should not be granted access. So if the score is equal to two or greater than two. Then jump to access is denied. In all other cases, jump to access is granted. So we've set up the logic jump perfectly. And now you can just give the form a name and then hit save. Always remember to name your form, otherwise you will not be able to save this. So before we save it, let's just take it for a test drive. Have you been quarantined in the last 14 days? Yes. Have you come in contact with someone who has tested positive? No. Have you been experiencing any symptoms? No. So I've answered only one question is yes and the other two is no. So access is granted. Let's see what happens when I answer two or more questions with the option yes. So I've answered all questions saying yes, and the access is denied. So that's it. It's just that simple to set up. 